My youth, let's go. Me, doctor, lawyer, scientist, and teacher. I'm a guy who read me that. How will you say him? He's a jebel. Okay. okay. There's a thing that I've been going around in the news lately regarding farm workers who travel from Jamaica to Canada and cause a lot of confusion and cause a lot of farm workers traveling from Jamaica who is unvaccinated um, to feel that they have been treated unfair. Um, knowing that you was a farm worker for many years, you know, mm. me just feel like to share this with you to hear your opinion. Mm. I have my opinion on the whole thing, but I want to hear your opinion on it too. So what, what really I go on based upon the news and based upon what I have read is mm -hmm. that unvaccinated farm workers in Jamaica mm -hmm. are not allowed to go to Canada be right. by the Jamaican government right. because they are unvaccinated. Right. What I've also read, in Canada, the, the person who giving those farm workers the contract to go mm. to Canada, contract to them, allow, are willing to accept them. Unvaccinated. Unvaccinated, but they have to be quarantined and being watched for 14 days. Right. So, those farm workers are saying, okay, since as they are willing to accept us as being unvaccinated, and quarantine us for two weeks. They're willing to do that? Yeah, why the Jamaican government is adamant that they are fully vaccinated mm -hmm. to travel? Well, I was reading in the um, Star where somebody from the Ministry of Labor in Jamaica said uh, it's like they don't have no control over it because Canada requires that everybody come in the country to be fully vaccinated. Mm -hmm. Like we have the U.S. have them vaccine mandate, Canada have them vaccine mandate. But when I read it, look like there is exceptions, temporary exceptions for farm workers who is going on a contract. Mm -hmm. if, the, if that is the case where they have an exemption for farm workers who is going on a temporary contract to travel and then quarantine after they reach Canada, mm. I believe the Jamaican government should make preparation where they can travel. Unvaccinated. Unvaccinated. Go on. You know, just like how ahead, they are ahead. willing to they, accept they, them they, there. They listen to you. Willing to accept them there and make them quarantine. Mm -hmm. That is just a temporary thing for the farm workers, not for everybody. Mm -hmm. Why they can't just open it up where they can travel? Unvaccinated. Unvaccinated. Enough you happen. Enough you happen. No. Why? Vaccinate. Vaccinate. Then Take it, the vaccination. Well, and that not seem like a force to you? No, no. It, no, a person said him no want it. Well, I know. But Wait, come, come out of the line. Come out. No, I'm going to show you. The pandemic with the corona disease and the, um, what do you call it? Sitting on the nine, right? Mm -hmm. Good. They say to kill people. The FDA, the Medical Association, say since as people are dead after the pandemic, they come up with a vaccine. Gentle people, gentle people, if your finger chop, and they say the most stitch on back your finger, would you, would you stop the first stitch it on back? Because you don't want to lose your finger, you know? Would you allow them to stitch it on back? Yes, because a medical doctor you go to. And it's a most teacher back your finger, you have a finger for use, right? No, pandemic, if corona vaccine sitting there kill people, they come up with the vaccine. Take the vaccine, bro! Take it! No, but everybody have a choice. Well I know. Choose for not take it, come out of the line. If you no vaccinate and come unvaccinated and catch the disease, who are you gonna blame? Yourself. All right. Well, come out of the line. But what I'm saying, if those who giving those farm worker contract in Canada, mm. willing, accepting them, and vaccine, he want making money. He no want losing money. 
then why, if, if they are accepting them, why you? Jamaica people right, Jamaica don't send them away unvaccinated when they come back here with the disease and they don't have to deal with. You have to take a vaccination, bro. Papa, I don't to touch a point. It's going to sound biased, but that's true. Take a chance, man. Because if you go, you go catch a disease and the member they must ship your ass back home. You know? Right? No. Sick are in a box. No, if you go there and take the and catch a disease. And vaccinate it. Vac you have you go and set yourself. But if we need to take a vaccine, we wouldn't catch a disease. No, sir. People who take it, the vaccine, still, still, still catching the right, disease good. and dead in, and dying well, from well, the, well, I know. the disease too. Well, we leave it right there. Because we could deal with it, you know. Sheep and goat. You want to go on the sheep side, go on the sheep side. You want to go on the goat side, go on the goat side. You want to take it, you take it. You want to take it, turn so back. But in your view, don't that look like it's dividing people? Of course it it's will divide. It's causing a division? It, it will be a big division. Sheep and goat. Who believe? Who truly believe? If you take it, you catch it. And if you don't take it, you catch it. I said... It makes I, sense? I, 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 well, no, I, 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 I said, you know what you do? Take it. Take it. Do it. Do it. You hear me say? Do it. So, your word... You can't go on the... They you, not put you on the plane unless you have a valid passport. Take the vaccine. So, with your, your, my, your word as a previous farm worker, to the unvaccinated farm workers who have a contract in Canada and, and can't travel unless they are fully vaccinated right. from Jamaica. Tell them, what would you the say to them? The choice is theirs. Yeah. You don't take it, go plant your corn in your country mm -hmm. and live there. You want to take it, take it and go to Canada and work. Leave the rest of it to God Almighty. We take you back home safe. So wouldn't you also encourage the Minister of Labour to send them? Unvaccinated? Yeah. No. Mm -mm. Don't send them unvaccinated. Because the facts still stand up. If you take a chance and send them unvaccinated and something wrong, the most of Jesus Christ if me take a vaccination, we wouldn't be sick. That's what I'm going to say. That's what I'm going to say. God, God Almighty, boy, if me take a vaccination, I'm be sick. But that is still ignorance because that not prevent them from sick. Still for all, the facts still remain. That not prevent them from sick. So, if you take it, you're sick. And if you not take it, take it! <laughs> <laughs> if they send them unvaccinated, remember this. And they come up and want mask to bite them. The most of Jesus Christ, God Almighty. It means just take a vaccine, you mask it out and bite me. Yeah, people always. We always we, um, said stuff like God that. God told us in His Word, this world that we live in, don't live down here. It have to go under rules and regulation by men, mankind. The only thing you need from up above there, hoping that the big house there some conscious, reasonable people to share the love and the rules and regulation to who under them. That's all we need. But a lot of those people who are setting rules and regulation, they are setting it to benefit themselves. Well, no, They're not setting it I'm for not, the greater I'm good, not, for the I'm bigger mass. I'm not talking about that we are talking. I'm saying that's all we need. Some reasonable people who up there. We need some reasonable people who have the art like me. You need reasonable people who have the art like you, but how much of them you can definitely say is reasonable? It's just like gold. Who, who, who can hold, put the hand on a pawn with a gold? My opinion on the whole matter is... Take the vaccination. My opinion is... US have a mandate. Canada have a mandate where vaccine is concerned. And their mandate is you can't come in their country unless you are fully vaccinated. vaccinated. That's their mandate, that's right. their policy. Right. And you, you cannot go around it because as you go to the airport, then we'll have to see that. Good. Good. Um, 
the, the people, the guys them have the contract in Canada to go do farm work, who are refusing to be vaccinated. Jamaica uphold their decision right. that they have to be vaccinated right. before they leave the country. Right. It's also possible if the Minister of Labour allow them to leave to go to Canada. Maybe they get stopped at the border. Right. Then they can't go in our country because when they look, they find us they're not in fully vaccinated. But the contract holder in Canada, I, I think I was reading where they have an exemption mm. for the farm workers. Mm. They let them in the country, but they have to be quarantined Good. and been watched for 14 days. Good. Those who are not willing to take the vaccine and they are still accepted to work, I would allow them to go and work. Get quarantined and then work after your quarantine. I would allow them to go. Okay, okay. If so would be the case, whoever do that, you dip on your ass, you dip on your hood. Yeah, of course, they pay your own. That's your choice. Okay. Just as though they make the choice not to Good. take it, they make the choice to go without agree, taking it. Okay, as you say, this country have the mandate, that country have the mandate. All right, break it down to your house, your house that you live in too. And you hear anybody you make tip in your door. Mm -mm. No, because you have the most smoke ganja in your house. I don't come to molest you to pick them. I don't come to molest your wife. I don't come to look at your teeth. So I don't hear any anybody. You have to know who you are letting in your house and grow in your food pot. Because people come that dirt and pies in your food pot. And so you break down. Whoever say anybody can come in my house, very careless. Careless. You don't care where the come in your house come down. You don't care what go up so you can come. Very careless. Careless. It's just unfortunate and it's not only those guys who have contract in Canada, but it rises across the globe. 